Strap off of you. <laughs> <laughs> you want to review this? <laughs> you actually brought this down. <laughs> Did you grab the power cord for this at least? No. Why? There's batteries in it. I don't know how long the sea batteries will last. They've been in this radio ever since I got it. And <laughs> Whoa, is it bent? What? The antenna. Uh, maybe a little bit, but it's whatever. It was choking me! Like- it around your fucking neck! I had no way to carry it! Uh, let's review this son of a bitch! Yes. Fuck you. Uh, I, I, you may be bi, but you may be. <laughs> you may be. You may be bi, but I'm not gay. Okay, okay, furry. Anyway, so. Uh, well, that's an angry pussy right there. And that can be taken two ways. So, how's oh <laughs> so how's it going, guys? This is Thunder Buddy 01 here, along with Clay Ranger 143. And so you see this. You see a TV that doesn't work. What the fuck? What? That's all I gotta say to Vector. What the fuck? Yeah, that's those are my thoughts. But this behemoth is actually a radio. Yes, it is. And we will be reviewing said radio. So yes, and this we shall because it has AM, FM, and. TV and <coughs> weather. Fucking unbelievable. <laughs> anyway, so on this episode of Radio Reviews, we're going to be taking a look at a very interesting weather radio and television combo here. That has a hand crank and a backwards speaker, and look at that. It has a hand strap that you can wrap around your fucking shoulder or neck as you saw me. Come down with it. It has yeah, two flash a uh, It has <laughs> two flashlights, one on the front and one on the back. Uh, and fuck. this behemoth is known as the one, the only Vector VEC 136. Jinx, you owe me a fucking water glass. No. Go go up and get it, bitch. Piece of shit will focus. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, so let's get down to business with this fucking television looking head ass receiver bitch. Okay, in all seriousness, the Vector Storm Tracker VEC 136 weather radio slash AM FM receiver slash TV receiver. So, Vector, I have one question. Again, what the fuck were you thinking? Seriously, let's take a quick glance. You don't even need to look at it quick to tell that it is an oversized piece of fucking shit. As we shall demonstrate in this review. 
So, the Vector VEC-136 came out in the mid-2000s, alongside the Vector VEC-438 handheld radio, which was reviewed in Season 9, as did another version of this TV receiver. That Mitchell has. What is that called? That is called the WC-300 DSV. Hey, joke's on you, Mitchell. I got, I got this one first. <laughs> but this is a different model. So we're going to be reviewing his anyway, unfortunately. They're the same damn thing. You don't know that. I am 100% certain they're the same damn thing. You don't own it, do you? I may not own it, but I've seen his videos and it's the same fucking thing. You know me, I just want to get as many episodes out as possible to reach 200. Ad revenue. Yes. So, uh, anyways, let's take a look at what we are dealing with here. Okay, why does why is the lighting on this so fucking garbage? I have no clue. Get better lighting next time. Yes. So, anyways, transition you... from this to this. Yes. Anyways, um, let's take a quick glance. A glance at this. So we have a tuning knob on here that powers on the radio itself and turns it on and off. You have this big fucking dial on the side. That's for the tuning of AM, FM. Actually, that is actually that is TV. just actually that is just for the TV. Oh, it's just for the TV. Yeah. Oh. Well, all right. Then. Anyways, and then then you have a a twelve three eight two style directional pad down there alongside the AM FM tuning and dial. Yeah, it kind of does look like that. And the and there's the volume knob. Yep. The volume knob is right here. And I believe like the 438, the the, vol the, the position of the volume knob affects the affects how loud the siren is. Um, now, if, yeah. now if you turn the radio around so the TV screen is facing towards the camera lens, that, that's, that is not the way I wanted it to turn. <laughs> so, I was trying to ma manage the big antenna this thing has. Yeah, look at this fucking thing. It's like a goddamn car antenna. <laughs> but anyways, so, you were saying. So, so up there you have the... Uh, the front, the three LEDs for the flashlight, and that wow, that actually doesn't fuck with the refresh rate. It just made it incredibly dark, like my soul. Yes. The, but um. The fucking focus. There we go. So you have two dials and a switch down there. You have the brightness switch for the television, for the television screen. And you have for a the contra contrast. Yep. And then in the middle, you have a a VHF low, VHF high, and UHF uh, slider. That stands for very high frequency low power, very high frequency high power, and then ultra high frequency. And unfortunately, this TV is of no use because analog television is dead. We just showed that side. Yeah, but I was going to put it here to show this. Oh. This is the strap that comes with the radio. Obviously, it's attached to it using two metal brackets. And you can either, if I put this antenna down, this big fucking antenna down, if I put that down and into the holder, you can either... Have it on your shoulder, like. By the way, sorry to interrupt, but we have a special guest on. Oh, oh, hey, look who it is! Oh, it's EAS Test Fan Twenty Five, the fucking Dazdek from Iowa. Oh, really? I thought I thought it was EBS Test Fan Nineteen Ninety Seven. Hi, Drew. But uh, yeah, hello, oh, Drew. Javier, would you mind turning on your camera to see what the fuck we're reviewing here? Uh, there. Hey, Drew! Yeah. Look at me! Can you try to expand it on my Yeah. Drew! Look at me! I got a TV! Oh, God! What? <laughs> here, go full screen. Go full screen right here. Option. Uh, oh, yeah. Just, yeah that, full screen. There we go. Oh, yeah. Look at me! Things. I got a TV! TV. Yeah, the Vector VEC-136. Yeah, but as I was demonstrating, quality. we could have the strap right here on my shoulder, around my neck, yeah. the front. That just looks like a pain. Yeah, and I've, and I've helped... I honestly, to me, that might be no, nothing, because I've carried... I've had a, a, bear, a Barry sax around, uh, with the neck strap around my neck. That is fucking painful. Those of you that are in, that are in band or or some sort of like marching band or something. If you hold a saxophone around your uh, with the neck strap around your neck, altos and tenors might be fine, but Barry's fucking hurt. And you have a bunch of saxes in that closet over there, right? Yeah. Oh boy. Um anyways, 
So now... On this side, you have the hand crank and the speaker right here. The speaker is actually really good, I will say that. I have tested it before, and it is pretty intriguingly good. Um, as we have showcased before with the antenna. Unfortunately, this is fucking tall as shit. Look at this. And this is all original. Why are you stroking it, you weirdo? One, oh, fuck off. One, two, three, right. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine fucking parts. And ten if you include the base. So yeah, a ten-piece antenna, and on the back you have another flashlight. With six arranged LED... Can't you key and will? Uh... Drew! Drew! Well, WLS, WGN, will any of them relay for that? Never mind. Anyways, so on the bottom you can see the ginormous battery cover as well as the model number that reads Vector Products Incorporated Model VEC 136, 4140 Southwest 30th Avenue in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Florida? Wow. Florida? Florida. Anyways, in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, 33312. TV, volt, very high frequency, low, channels 2 to 6, very high frequency, high, channels 7 to 13. Ultra high frequency is channel 14 to 83, with FM being on 88.108 megahertz, and AM is being on 530 point, or dash, or dit, or tit, I don't know. <laughs> 1710 kilohertz. Um, weather radio is 162.400 dash 162.550 megahertz. Seven channels. The power takes a DC 12 volt AC adapter or a car adapter of the same voltage. It has nine C batteries. Nine. You heard that right. Nine Let C me batteries. Show you what I mean. Oh, Javier. And of course, like the FRX5 LL Bean edition that we reviewed in fucking Red Bank, Virginia. 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 <laughs> Virginia. I was just testing your attention. I was just testing your attention. Yeah, just, like, just like Country Woes of West Virginia. Country Woes. West Virginia. But, um, no. When we were in Red Bank, New Jersey, we reviewed the FRX5 LL Bean edition. And that had the same procedure that you would do to take out the batteries or unscrew the covers. So, by unscrewing this... Look at this... Fucking monstrosity! Javier... Yes? Behold... The battery backup method... Nine C batteries. Okay, I, I have one serious question to ask. What? Yes. <laughs> Who in their right mind uses C battery? I'm sorry if that was too loud. I'm sorry if that was too loud. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll get a text saying if it was. Where is my phone? But yeah. Who in their right mind uses C batteries? And why would you use C batteries? Okay, my phone's over somewhere over there. Oh. Hey, Drew. Drew. Nine C batteries. Nine C batteries. Oh yeah, and if you're wondering about why the batteries are mixed, yeah, this that that those were the batteries from the seller. That was not of any of my doing. So that's another thing that the seller fucked up on. Leaving hey. the batteries in the fucking radio during hey, shipping. Hey, 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 at least they work and they still have juice in them. Yeah, but they would have leaked. Oh yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure it does. But uh, <laughs> yeah, it needs a fucking battery screw, which requires a goddamn coin to get it loose. Yeah, it would probably die quicker. I for, I honestly have to look at the manual to see what the ba what the TV requires. I think the TV requires nine batteries and the uh, the nine C batteries and the. Well, then again, the TV portion is useless now because there's no more analog stuff. No TV more stations. They're all dead. As of this recording, as a matter of fact, 
Just the remaining low power analog TV transmitter signed off the air last month around this date. So, unfortunately, we cannot demonstrate the TV functionality because, yep, completely dead. Where is my, okay, I, oh, there it is. <laughs> Thank you. Anyways, yeah. Where do we start? Oh, son of a bitch. All right, all right. I know where to start. The button beeps. Yep, the button beeps. All right, let's start with that. Okay, the button beeps on the Vector VEC-136. Yeah, it does that. And, uh, yeah, let's just say if you press a certain amount of, if you press the, if you spam the program and store button. It... Here, let me, let me do it. All right. Are you having fun over there? <laughs> oh, well, I thought I could get it to do the, damn it. Oh, bruh. <laughs> uh, oh my god, did we actually fucking do it? What? Nope. We did it. We did it. We actually soft locked the radio. We did it. If you if you press the buttons a certain amount of times, it will actually reset as if it's soft locked. It just did that. What a piece of shit. It just did it, bro. Here, let me try something. It just, it did. <laughs> My dilly dong dick can suck the fucking firmware of this piece of shit. How can a dick suck the firmware? Shut up. So, yeah, those are the button beeps. Now, allow me to pull up my phone to demonstrate the siren, or lack thereof, that this has. Oh, you think that's a siren? But you may be mistaken. This is the worst siren I've ever heard in my entire life. Okay, the siren on the Vector VEC-136. Let me tell you, it's shitty. So here is the watch and warning siren. I scroll down. That is that is the that is the vector 136's uh, warning and watch siren. What now. about statement? <laughs> I can tell you are visibly disgusted. I do not blame you one bit. Uh, you call that a siren? You legit call that a siren? And he's gone. Maybe that's why Vector went out of business so fucking soon. 
Oh my gosh. Why, Vector? Why would you do that? Because yes! But no, this fucking behemoth has one of the worst sirens I've ever heard in my entire life. And it's Unf literally, oh my, it's an embarrassment to sirens. It is. It legit It's a fucking embarrassment. And yeah. Like, who wants to hear a fucking television receiving radio with weather capabilities and AMF and bullshit go... The 438 siren. I would if they if this TV thing had the 438 siren, that would be okay. I'll, that would be great. I remember hearing the freaking 438 siren quite a bit. But this is an embarrassment. This whole fucking siren thing is an embarrassment. It is. Why would they make a siren so crappy? I don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? Huh? Huh? Your voice cracked, bro. <laughs> and there's crap on the camera lens. Again? Yeah. Anyways. So. Oh, holy blurry. Oh, there we go. So, on that note, what's the next feature, Nicholas? Uh. Because there's a lot. Honestly, I'm gonna have to complain about the setup. Let's do that! <laughs> Yeah. Okay, the setup on the Vector VEC-136. Alright, it's garbage. It is, but at least it's better than the frickin' 438. I will give it that. Well, let's so, take a look at how shitty this version so, is. So, to get to the menu, press this program store button. Yeah, yeah you, have to, you have to deal with staticky button beeps. So, <laughs> first thing you see is alert mode. So, to access this menu, it's like the 262 and 521, uh, not the 521, the frickin' 382. Uh, yeah, the 38. Yeah, actually, more so the 261, really. But you press this button, the uh, channel snooze button, because for some reason this has a fucking alarm clock. And you have off siren, which means it'll sound continuously until you, I think, you press the button. I've never tested that. And voice, which obviously it'll sound for a few seconds. And I have noticed that this is a first header radio. It is. Oh, yep. I it'll oh do God. The thing just like the 519, huh? Wait, what do you mean? Like, it'll activate on the, on the uh, first header, like the first gen oh, 519. Yeah. yeah, that's what I mean. And channel. Jeez, this thing is so bugged, I swear to God. Yeah, so you can change the channel through here. <laughs> or you can change it through the, the uh, directional pad down here. Alarm. <laughs> okay, there we go. Again, you can have it either bugged. off or on. It's basically, it's basically. so that bugged. That thing is so bugged. It, and time set. You can clock. or you can choose date. between clock and date. You know, I am turning this off. <laughs> no, I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Yeah. Oh, hey, flashlight. <laughs> that is so loud. And mm -hmm. county. You have between all, multiple, and single. And you... Imagine if we soft locked the radio during the. <laughs> Wait, did we just do that? We 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 soft lock. And on that note, let's talk about the let's talk about another complaint that I have about this radio, and that is the firmware. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, the firmware on the Vector VEC-136. If I may take over for this segment. All right. Okay, so you hold the camera here. How about you hold it? I see. Anyways. <laughs> um, the firmware. The fucking, the firmware. I apologize for the extremely bouncy video. We are filming this yeah, on Yeah, we're on an air mattress, and uh, look at this. Bouncy. All right, what? if you could just turn the uh, Anyways. radio over. There we go. All right, look at this bullshit. You just saw the firmware completely soft lock itself while we were setting up the radio, or at least trying to go through the setup to demonstrate how fucking terrible it was. 
So I think personally, that's just my opinion, but I personally think that the setup on the 136 is worse than the 438 because of the buggy firmware. It is. I didn't want that bitch. Why the fuck does it do that? I have no freaking clue. Hmm? Why the fuck? Why? Because vector. Vector logic. It's not working. Are you having fun with that? Watch it, watch it just break the radio by pressing the freaking. There we go. Yeah. This is why this piece of shit is a piece of shit. This. Don't hit the radio. Stop. Piece of shit. Don't hit the radio. That is mine. Radio Don't. lives matter. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah. I'm pretty Wait, sure just you, like, just you like, have just, your own say in this. Just, just like how door lives matter. Design and Mox, you're welcome. Get on with the fucking <laughs> firmware complaints. <laughs> so yeah, um, see, I don't, I don't absolutely ass rape the buttons. Oh, fuck you! You did the same damn thing. <laughs> All right, so I may not, I may not completely butt rape the buttons, but. I I do I do have my fair share of complaints for the firmware because yeah it is definitely not the best like it honestly makes honestly you know what no I was gonna say that this is worse than running snails but at least when running snails soft locks well actually no when running snails soft lock you have to set everything back up yourself at least with this it fixes everything for you so like, let's say if the uh, if the radio crashes, I'm just gonna turn this off so the batteries don't die. But mm -hmm. let's say if this radio completely dies, it loses power. I, actually, no. Let's say if you're setting up the radio, it it freezes up, it restarts, and it saves everything that you had. Like it has the uh, like it has all the, uh, the the date and time saved. It has your channel settings saved. With the with the running sales, specifically the V9s. 13s and 17s it may just save your stuff as far as like channel selections and all that but it will not save the date and time not on the running snail right nope not on the running <laughs> snail but um yeah but on the vector it does save it yes like you can see it's still saved So yeah, at least when it soft locks itself, and when it resets, it still has your date and time saved completely. That it does. So, I think that just about covers the, why the fuck is my watch orgasming, uh, L. Potential Tropical Cyclone 6. So, my radar posted that too. Imagine my radar in 2021. That's why I use Radar Scope. Radar Scope Supremacy. Anyways. So now that we've covered the the glitchy firmware, why don't we talk about something that also is a, okay, I say it's a bad feature, but it would have been good had it still been around. And that would be the analog television settings. Okay, the analog television on the Vector VEC-136. The elephant in the room here with this fucking radio. The elephant in the room. Now I bet all of you were just, just foaming at the mouth to see this fucker work, but unfortunately it won't. Because as you know, analog TV stations have unfortunately signed off the air for good back in 09 and the low power ones have shut off 
just last month in fact. So there's literally no possible way to get this thing working again. Unless there's like some sort of like, unless you have like some sort of like a hijacking device or something. But unless you could have a transmitter of your own, that's different. But I think the FCC would be on your ass, even if it was privately owned, I don't even know. But all we know is analog TV is fucking dead. And as a result, when you try and turn on the radio, or at least the television portion of the radio, this will happen. That is, oh, maybe it has to be plugged in for the screen to show up, I don't know. That is bleed through, definitely. That is definitely bleed through. You think we might have to plug it in for the TV? I believe so, but the. Well, I mean, let's. Fuck it. Let's go try it. Okay, I will pause the recording. I am too lazy to get up, so. The cord should be on the little power tower. It's a big black brick. Oh, I know what it is. Okay. I already unplugged it anyway. All right. So let's go try it out. All right. Okay, so I'm up here in the realm known as Nicholas's dark radio room, or one of his dark radio rooms at the, at the moment, but uh, yeah, I got the television on right here, and look what happens. Yeah, the screen works and everything, it's just that it cannot receive any analog TV stations because like we said, they are all dead, and not just that, it absolutely messes up the refresh rate on the camera. And it's the same thing for all types of bands. Whether it's ultra high frequency, not a damn thing. Very high frequency, high power, or even VHLL, VHFL, sorry. Unfortunately, not a single thing can make the television work again. Because, yeah, the television is just obsolete. So it's a pretty useless feature. But thinking back to like the early days of analog TV and such, like the 2000s, it would have been a, a definitely it would have been a useful feature at the time. But unfortunately, times have changed. And now we have no analog TV whatsoever. Everybody has converted into digital and any remaining analog TV station in the United States is offline. So, unfortunately, that's that. <laughs> I am now. Ah, uh, DX! <laughs> oh, it's somebody, somebody yeah. joined. Chandler just joined, and yes, we have more guests this time around. Please, Please. welcome Rudy Octoling, Chandler Fogel, ESS Fan 25, Mr. Riot, and Chaos. <laughs> Chaos Mox. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. Do I need to get the fucking zone guard? No. <laughs> do it. No, do <laughs> it. There's <laughs> one behind you. Michael, there's one behind you. Michael, Michael, there's one behind you. Oh, jeez. Oh, wait to see this episode when it comes out right now. Me too. Just to get an idea of what you guys are seeing. <laughs> So all these, so all these two fight like alley cats in, in the in the back streets of Bridgeport. <laughs> damn, Michael! Damn, Michael! You sucking yourself off down there? I have, I have, I have, I have. I know I just threw it. 
Oh, jeez. I, I have a sharpie. All right, so. Oh, even better. <laughs> <laughs> we'll use a green sharpie. <laughs> 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 oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> this isn't even radio reviews anymore. This is fucking <laughs> Oh Jesus. What is going on? <laughs> no. Oh, that fucking God. hurt. Good God. <laughs> Anyways, so let's. You know what? Why, why, why isn't this staying still? <laughs> Fuck. Anyway, so. <laughs> Are you sure it's not too late to send them in, to to China? Uh, man, that hurt. I, I, that hurts. Do it. That hurts. Send him to send, send Michael to Brazil. You know what? That's not a bad idea. I'm gonna need a million stamps though. <laughs> Anyways, so I saw him peeking. Oh, you mean this sharpie? <coughs> you, you good? You good? Yeah, I'm good. All right. So. I'm gonna need more water though. All right. So. That, that, that was fucking gold. Yeah. Alright, so, okay. so let's... Okay, Michael, you can come out of the blanket now. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. Alright. Let's get back Yes, to Rudy, that. yes. Yeah. Alright, so... Do you... Do you... You're panning really hard. You sure you weren't sucking yourself off on it? Oh. <laughs> All right, so. Oh shit. <laughs> anyway, so let's. Looking uh, at his OnlyFans right now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> yes, Mox, he did. Anyway, so let's get back to the. You so, should practice demo. Is it motherfucking? Uh, is it goddamn new hip? <laughs> <laughs> new hip shit again? Would not be surprised. But anyway, so. Let's get back to the antenna on this radio. I think that's what we were about to cover next. Yes, the antenna. So, as you can see, it is big. That's it what is, she said. It is wobbly, and that's God fucking said. damn it. <laughs> it, is, it, is, it is big, it is wobbly, it is unstable as shit. That is what she said, too. I'm done. <laughs> hey, shit ass, Rudy's trying to talk to you. Yeah. He's looking at his OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Anyways, so back to the end. so miracle. So by some miracle, I managed to I managed to actually shut the camera off. <laughs> <laughs> he just took that out of his ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Anyways, so so the antenna is definitely something interesting to look at. It's a. Uh, it's, it's got like it's got nine segments, so ten if you if you include the base. You know I'm still gonna put this next to you when you're asleep. <laughs> Don't get any ideas. <laughs> Too fucking late. God damn it! It's a, it's a mix of it's a mix of what shit these guys do every night and mix of radio reviews at the same time. Yeah. And as, as Michael continues to, uh, to, to pleasure himself... <laughs> oh, wow. And he's also, uh, recording his pleasure on his only channel. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was no, he, he wouldn't, he wouldn't, he, he doesn't do that on his only fans, he does it on TikTok. That was Oh, shit. <laughs> Anyways, so... I can't even see it. Anyways, um, the antenna. First of all, this has to be one of the longest tallest antennas for any weather radio we have ever seen in the history of this series. Because not only is it the original antenna, it is also possibly the most... How do I say this? 
for the top part. It's possibly the most sensitively... Eh, it's the most sensitive antenna you can have on the radio because look at how flimsy it is towards the top from how tall it is. Not to mention, it's already fucking bent. Not to mention, that looks so wrong in so many ways. <laughs> bent dick antenna. How how would you 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 know that? See what I'm doing here? I'm not even well, why, why any you, force why, to it. Why did you call it a dick antenna? <laughs> because it bends easily. But you see my problem with this antenna. It's a bit too large. But I can also tell why they did it. <laughs> um, oh, Jesus. It is a bit too large for its own good. Like an erect penis. <laughs> not that I know, not that I would know what that looks like. Oh, 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 yeah, oh wait, yeah. oh wait, I'm, I'm a guy, never mind, okay. I'm, 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 fuck, nobody need to know that. <laughs> nobody needed to know that. <laughs> um, anyways, um, I just walked myself right into that one. But you get the point. I think the antenna is a bit too large, but I can, I can see why they made it so big on the radio. Because it would like, it... Since it's a television, it would definitely need a good antenna to grab at least some form of television signal, at least at the time when analog television stations were still a thing back then. So I can see why they made it so big, and I can see why it's also thick at the base too. It's like, the thickness of the base is actually not that far off from a modern WR-100, actually. If you really think about it, it's not too far off. It really isn't, it's just... It's just humongous. It is. Humongous. Like, I have never seen an antenna so tall from the factory before. I have Hi. never seen that. Daddy long legs. Yes, daddy long leg antenna. Daddy long leg spider antenna. Uh, no, let's not mention spiders here. No, I fucking hate spiders. I do too. Well, then why the fuck did you mention it? Well, she said daddy long leg. Rudy said daddy long leg, so it just made me think of daddy long leg spiders. So there you go. We can hardly hear them. Uh, is the volume all the way up? Yeah, let me see. When you, when you hit a spider, it gives birth. There we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, good God. So. <laughs> Dick! I finally got you, bitch ass! Oh, jeez. Hold on, hold on. Uh, 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 Alright, let's keep it down, let's keep it down a little bit. Let's, let's keep it down a little bit. My dad's sleeping upstairs. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. This... My arms, pubic hairs! Jesus. <laughs> what are you guys doing? I'm just trying to tag my arms. Mark on my arms, too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. What has this turned into? <laughs> no idea. <laughs> I think this episode reveals what happened to technical difficulties. Oh, just Jesus. Just a little bit. Yeah. Technical difficulties, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I'm not. I'm not. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, that's Katie's. Don't hurt my Zongar. That's also Katie's Sharpie. <laughs> Oh god! Why are you that me? Oh gosh! I'll, it's on Michael's camera, so I'll, I'll see if he can send it to you. This is. Oh gosh! Ah, Run! Quit trying to rape me! Where's my phone? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is you get under, under the bed? <laughs> <laughs> Where's my phone? You <laughs> <laughs> can't have sex in this room with a singular closet in it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Can you, Michael, can you hand me my phone? <laughs> oh my god. That's my blanket and that's my shirt. Michael cross dressing confirmed. <laughs> 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 I don't even know anymore. Are you good, neighbor? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh Jesus Christ. Why is it with the vector episodes the funniest shit happens? I guess so. I think this just outdid the 438. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> Michael, you might need to get one of the batteries out of my camera bag. This is almost at two, this is already at two bars. <laughs> oh, I don't want that shit. I don't want to know where it's been. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh. Uh, okay. Oh. Right. Once again, I needed, I needed this laugh. Oh my god, oh, Jesus. I fucking needed it. Oh gosh. Oh. Alright. Let's... Where the fuck were we? I don't uh, remember. Let's get to the speaker quality next. <laughs> Alright. So, after that, and we actually managed to get the entire thing this time, <laughs> we're gonna be focusing on the speaker quality next. So let's so let's go to the weather band real quick because Michael, stop looking at your only fans. <laughs> I'm texting Orbit. Oh, okay. Orbi. <laughs> By the way, if you're watching this, we love you, Orbi. <laughs> right, I'm gonna mute the I'm gonna mute the micro. Oh shoot! I'm gonna mute the I'm gonna mute the mic real quick because I don't know how loud this is gonna go. So. Yeah, just a heads up. I, that's that's we'll, we'll be muted for a little bit. We don't want to ear rape the VC. However, life-threatening rip currents are always possible in the vicinity of groins, jays, reefs, and piers. Moderate risk. Life-threatening rip currents are possible in the surf zone. Anyone planning to enter the surf should check with local beach patrols first. Mm -hmm. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. That's the funniest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, that was. That was honestly hilarious. And thank you for watching Saturday Night Live. Yeah. <laughs> Even though it was taken on a Monday night. You know what? Zero fucks given. So. <laughs> so, honestly, the speaker quality is kind of, oh, it's actually really good. 
it actually manages to maintain its control even when it's a uh, even when it's at freaking uh, full volume. <laughs> and honestly, so those of you and uh, know why the radio freaks might know what I'm referring to, but this speaker makes WXM80 sound wireless, even though they're phone line. Dude, you're shaking. <laughs> Wait, you're am shaking. I? Am I really? Yeah. yeah. Oh you, my God, you, you are. are shaking. Dude. Oh God. Oh. Oh God, I don't think I've ever laughed this hard in a long time. In all honesty, we needed that laugh. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, we did. So, <laughs> I, I, am I, am I really shaking though? That's the, that's the main question. I do. Yeah, look at your fingers, dude. Yeah, they are legit shaking. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was definitely one of them. <laughs> <laughs> We may as well turn money coins into fucking money. <laughs> Dick, you got it on my shorts. Get, get, you got it on me! Oh, hey! It's gone now. Deep, hey, don't, don't ruin my sharpie now. Oh, gosh. Anyways. Dude, you got it on the freaking sheet. Bruh. That's from my arm! See? <laughs> You're in trouble. No, see, it's from my fucking arm. Uh, I could probably use a stain stick on that one. Uh. No, no, here, here. <laughs> oh great, Michael, 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 this is poor bed sheet. That that bed sheet is being violated. Bed sheet life's matter. Fuck you and your bed sheet permissions and opinions. <laughs> I'm not gonna draw on you. Relax. Why are you freezing again? Here. <laughs> there you go. Oh my god. All right, I want to hold this real quick. Okay. So, so now that we've covered the uh, the speaker quality, let's let's move on to the next feature. As I have as I have green Sharpie on my freaking freaking on my what? Uh, oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> so, now that we've got. I'm in my fucking bedsheet coffin. <laughs> Do not disturb my peace and serenity. Hey, have, fun, have fun on Grinder, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, he's gonna get. He's gonna get buried on that, and then we're gonna dump his body into the Connecticut River. Who's the tonic river? It's closer. Okay, now we're. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Bruh! Dude, that, that sounded like a legit hurt. Yeah, it did. <laughs> it, that did hurt. <laughs> Bitch ass. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, oh God. no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Sweet <laughs> shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh oh god. god. Here we go again. Oh no. This isn't a right for music anymore. Oh gosh, I don't even know what to call this now. Is this, is this radio reviews or what? No, this is this is uh, this no, is a this, fucking no, this radio. Is, this is radio reviews rated R. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> Rated R for repeatedly <laughs> hey, hey, hey. hey, that's assault. <laughs> <laughs> you break it, you're buying me another one. <laughs> Rated R for repeatedly <laughs> suggesting. <laughs> oh gosh. Alright, so let's let's focus on the reception next. Yeah. Oh my god, Michael. <laughs> and that is the first thing we see when we record this part. Damn, Michael, you better fucking better fucking pound that laptop like it's your own. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know you like the Kansas oh cops, but God damn. <laughs> Nicholas. <laughs> Yeah, damn, bro. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, God damn it! They fucking posted it in the chat! God damn it! Look up! 
Oh, it's right there. It's right there. How do you zoom in this thing? Uh, there's a there's a little this right uh, here. slider uh, on the okay. top. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh, this thing's. Oh, oh wow, this thing zooms in really good. <laughs> hey, where's the where's the? Can you pass me the zoom over real quick? Yeah. <laughs> wow, this thing this okay. thing zooms this thing this thing zooms in really good. Yeah. I like I like. <laughs> I like, I like this. Oh wait, we just missed that. Oh no. And you moved the bed. Oh Michael. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you doing? Do you guys have the other battery ready? Because this one's about to die soon. Yeah, 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 that one's, I'll, I'll get another yeah, that one's dying. Alright. Please hold on while we switch camera batteries. Uh, so, oh, how y'all doing tonight? Good. Doing great. Y'all doing great over there, huh? Yeah. I'm just gonna live on the Yeah. Alright, that's cool. That's cool. So, while we wait to get another camera battery, this one is still kind of working. Katie, say hi. Hi. <clears throat> We're gonna take a look what's, at a wild my, uh, Michael in his natural habitat. What's, what's my Let's go do that. My, uh, uh -huh. But yeah, we'll go ahead and see what what wild Michaels do in their natural habitat. 59%. Right. Sleeping and taking a shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh Michael. Is he sleeping and taking a shit? <laughs> yeah, he did. God damn it! <laughs> what are you doing? I'm recording you. Why? Because I can. Not gonna lie, I like, I like, I like how that camera's. I like camera zooms in Whoa, man. We just turned this perfect for real. Oh, no. What? We're also recording. Alright. Alright, give me a second. Oh, my <laughs> dick! <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna be so we're gonna be going over the reception of the Vector VEC 136 as we have more people joining the party. We got Break Orbit up there, who you just saw us meeting up with in a prior episode. We also we get... love you still. Yes, we do. We also got Makoto Maniac down here, and we also got North Utah WXEAS right here. And we have Radioactive Girl 00 in the party as well. And uh, this dick right here is Nicholas Jr. Chandler Fogel. Really? <laughs> Oh god. Oh god. Snorts all around. Let's snort some cocaine while we're at it. Mm. Oh god. Ooh. Somebody else join? Uh, no. No, Chandler just turned Anyways, on the camera. So, let's test out the reception. Shall we? Yes. That's <laughs> So in here, the reception is dog shit. Well, we're, we're apart from getting WXM80, right? We're right next to a computer, you dummy. It doesn't matter because if I put it over here, the same fucking thing. It's not like you have to look at it, gay ass. I never said I was gay. Then why are you looking at it so much? He doesn't have it. He got ass fucking yoga shorts. No. Bleh.
Anyways. Drew, you bitch. What did Drew do? Oh my god! Damn it! Motherfucker out here looking about to take a dozen hot dogs. Yeah, as, yeah, as you as you insert a whole Italian sausage in your mouth. Yeah, says your dad. Yeah, chorizo, bitch. Ooh, fucking mirror shot, bitch. The mirror shot. It's Joe Biden's younger self. No. Okay, bro, I, I, I would not want to associate myself with Joe Biden. At least he, he sniffs kids, I don't. Okay, I'm sorry. It's Justin Miller. Justin Bieber Nicholas. Really? You're gonna quit? You're gonna quit? <laughs> yeah. Justin Bieber. Anyways, as I was gonna demonstrate here. <laughs> Anyways. Radio, I will kill you. What did she do? What she hit the picture of me trying to freaking chomp on the antenna. Oh my god, yes. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh. <laughs> Orbit, come on. Oh no, what, is, what does she do now? She replies saying deep flow. You can't do that when I'm when I'm on the other side of the country, so hot. Who says I can't? Who says I can't sneak in Javier's luggage and, and walk down there? <laughs> Thunder Simpo Three. Oh Jesus Christ! Thunder Simpo Three. Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God, Chandler. Okay. Why you guys fuck around? What? I want to film the outdoor segment. You can come with me. Okay. I'm not coming with you. That is gross. <laughs> you know what I fucking meant? This is gonna be a long video. Yeah, probably. But yeah, uh, yeah. All right, you can you can come outside with the vector, and we'll test out the outdoor reception from there. <laughs> oh my god. Hey Michael, you're fucking gay. <laughs> Half gay. Thank you very much. Half gay. Yeah, bye. Wow. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Give me my phone. Give me the camera. Oh, blackmail, eh? I'm not black male, I'm not black. Oh, white male, eh? I'm pale as fuck, how am I white? Ow. You can you can do that to you can do that to your you can do that to your boyfriend, but you can't do that to me. Why weren't you here a minute ago? Okay, okay, Mo. Here we see the camera. I want to hold the camera, Okay. Okay, you can resume. <laughs> Damn, bro, are you trying to cup slap me? Hey. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> I saw some interesting nice. shit from your DMs. Where? <laughs> just, just, just look at your notifications. <laughs> <laughs> Makoto! Makoto, you're a god! Makoto? God damn it! <laughs> he saw it! He saw what you sent me! So he knows what you mean now! Okay, <laughs> Makoto, you are God. What, Makoto? What'd you say? He's God. Makoto, what did you say? I'm an innocent child. No, you're not, bitch. 
Makoto, you are far from innocent. I, I, I've been in VC. You are, you are not innocent at all. You're a devious bitch. Yes. I never did anything wrong. Yeah, my, 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 my ass. Yeah, commenting about my yoga pants making my ass pop out is surely in the sun. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking got that. I got that. I got that. What did you do? Okay, we're not. We're not. <laughs> oh god. I like I said, this is Radio Reviews Rated R. What the hell are you doing over there? Damn, bro. I thought this was the luck! He hit his head on the freaking vector. <laughs> Fucking dumbass. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> I'm getting a headache. Oh my god. Hey, is it is there a pick up on this? Yeah, go right ahead, go right ahead. I think there should be a plug under there. No one oh. No one wants to see it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! Uh, my coat what? Look what you've done! Taco Bell's not happy there. Uh, <laughs> that's like what's the second time that's doing that. Oh! You mean this? <laughs> I freaking missed that. Do it again. <laughs> ah, yes, we see the. Hey, we see the Thunder Thighs ass! I will fucking murder you for that. Thank you. What is happening? I don't know. Turn the turn the laptop around. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't do anything yet. Don't do anything yet. Don't Hey, 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 we, hey, we didn't want to see that. We didn't want to see that. We, we did not want to see that shit. See what? Exactly. Hey, the Hey, God. You almost ain't shit, too. Take a look. Yeah, what's up? What's up? You mind if you mind if you mind if yeah. Oh, right. oh, look at this. Right. Look at this. Oh, whoa. Oh, we're, we're. Oh, we got to we do we got to guest star right now. Banna. It's for Oh shit. Yo. Banna Montana. Oh, no six. Yo, it's Banna Minnesota 704. The Hannah Montana. I am like legit thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> Who in the name of fuck burp? Who in the name of fuck burp? <laughs> Who in the name of fuck burp? <laughs> oh hey, congratulations. You are now on the internet. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh no! 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 Damn! You know, at this point, I don't give a shit. I'm still gonna beat your ass for that. A beat my ass? What are, you, what are you gay for me now, too? No, I have Katie for that. 
shit. Wait, don't buy that. Alright. I want to. I'm going to take the camera if you don't mind. And, uh. Can we go outside now? Uh, that you. That sounds so suggestive. I'm going to so fucking. Oh, shit. Alright, in all seriousness, let's. let's, 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 let's I will carry the rec the vector. Get your ass off that bed. I don't want no Michael Cooties on there. <laughs> <laughs> I'd just be glad they're not dirty like Melissa's. Or <laughs> just, just, just be glad I'm not even one of those bitches. Oh shit! <laughs> you do a spit take. I'm not liable for your damages. <laughs> <laughs> hey. All right, Who's so going first? I'm going first, it's my fucking house, bitch. So, let's... So, let's go and film the freaking outdoor reception now. Alright, so... Oh god, I can see that fucking face. It's happen... Boy. It's happening here. Alright, so let's film the outdoor reception, reception part of the uh, vector now. I got it. I got it. And here are the latest observations for Southern Connecticut. Mostly cloudy. A chance of showers and thunderstorms in the evening. Chance of rain 30%. Still actually 42. Yeah, the, he's actually causing interference. Channel 2, nothing. Channel 3. Channel 4. Wave period 9 seconds. At the buoy 23, not a heat index values may exceed. WWH 33. No, really, I thought it was WWH 26. It's unable to escape. There's KW 35. The UV index definition is plus more on with current and beach safety. See HTTP. Who the fuck are you calling a moron, Upton? Beach slash OKX for the following areas. Oh wait, in is this Jersey, Morris, this is the heat advisory. Middlesex in Western Monmouth. Excessive. Is orbit in Western or Eastern Monmouth? Um, Northeastern Monmouth. What? Oh, Dangerously sorry. hot conditions with heat index yeah, values middle around 100 try possible. When? From Wednesday oh, afternoon you, you, through Friday. You skipped the where. Impacts. Extreme heat and humidity will significantly increase the potential for heat-related illnesses, particularly for those working or participating in outdoor activities. Monitor the latest forecasts and warnings for updates on this situation. Be prepared to drink plenty of fluids, stay in an air-conditioned room, stay out of the Sunday, and check up on relatives and neighbors. Young children and pets should never be left unattended in vehicles under any circumstances. This is especially true during warm or hot... <laughs> what the fuck are you rapping about? Stay out of the Sunday. Fuck off! <laughs> you sure you won't wake up from that? Oh gosh, I don't know. But oh god. Let's move on. I don't know what feature we're gonna do next. Probably the hand crank or something. No, the AM FM. AM FM. I may as well stay outside for that. He's gone! <laughs> you fucking lunatic! Oh gosh, while well, he's gone, I'm gonna go ahead and start on the AM and FM segment. So, alright. This will be definitely interesting to do. So, this radio has AM and FM capabilities, so if I go to AM, let's see. This is a WCBS 880, and I'm going to mute FM real quick, go to 
Oh my god! Freaking WRCN is just coming in so crap on this radio. But there's a brief overlook of the AM and FM capabilities. Um, quite honestly, the one complaint that I have is that this tuning knob, it, it does not like to stay accurate and you can screw off your stupid moth. So the tuning isn't exactly precise, so you might, as you, like, it, it basically combines digital tuning with analog tuning. And that does not turn out well. Like, why couldn't they have made the the AM and FM tuning the same way that you can they change the different weather channels on here? And another, honestly, that's that's a major drawback to the AM and FM functionality on this on this radio. But now we are going to talk about something a little bit different. We're going to be talking about the flashlights next. The flashlights next. Alright, so this radio comes equipped with two different flashlights. There's one up here, and there's one back here. I think this is technically called a reading lamp, but we're going to focus on this first. So, you can see it kind of lights up uh, pretty dimly over there. If I, uh, let's see, if I turn off, if I turn off my uh, phone's flash real quick, you can see it just faintly lights up right over there. It lights up the Weather Channel logo pretty well, but if I set this, you can kind of see a little bit of my feet. It's kind of a freaking. There we go. You can kind of see my feet a little bit. Um, you can see it lighting up part of my house. Little focus. Yeah, it kind of lights up my house pretty well. Um, this is pretty good for like short, uh, like, like, uh, like in a, in a, uh, in a short instance type of thing that, Michael, where the fuck did you go? Bruh. Slightly hypnotized by spectral frequencies, conditions may apply, data rates and services are for extra charge. What? While you were gone, I managed to do the entire AM and FM functionality on this radio. Hello. Fuck. I am short, sweet, and to the point. Short, sure, sweet, and to the point. Pussy <laughs> crap on fair. Short, sweet, and to the point. Oh god, I remember that episode. Uh, let's move that out of the way. And now let's talk about this light right here. This actually, I believe, is a reading light. That is the reading light. It lights up the side of my house pretty well, if I'm honest. Uh, even though it was like just a small circle. If anything, this is more so for like if you're if you're reading a what the fuck are you doing? I don't understand. If it's just six LEDs, it shouldn't just be a single circle, you know? It's probably, probably a reflector. Yeah, maybe I don't. But either way, it's. I mean, maybe because the light expands, like as it as it leaves the uh, the center of the bulb. But uh. Give yes. Some love. Yes. Anyways, so now that we've covered the, all right. Honestly, the the, the lights are a little bit. They're they're good for like when you're inside if you're looking around for something, but they are not, not outside. outside. Yeah. They suck outside. If it'll focus, there we go. Okay, the hand crank on the Vector VEC 136. Yes, this fucking behemoth of a radio has a hand crank. And we're gonna use it. A crank it, Vector. Damn, I said crank it, not give it a blowjob. <laughs> I mean, it feels nice. It is a little bit thick. Oh, by the way, it's actually called the Dynamo. But who cares? It's the hand crank. And you can see that the hand crank is placed conveniently right next to the speaker here. 
But um, yeah, other than that, I mean, the hand crank, it does feel very nice. Just as a hand crank alone, it feels pretty usable. But I don't see how you're going to get much life back into the radio when it's constantly using 9C batteries. There is actually a rechargeable battery pack inside the, the radio. I'm not sure where it is. It's been a while since I've taken the batteries out. Probably underneath all the C batteries. Yeah. But... Oh, one minor detail. I do like how the TV knob, when you scroll it, it makes the TV icon go faster than the actual turning of the knob. Oh hey, this this is like a, this this is like the fast death of the analog TV. Yes. But um, other than that, um, why don't we go back inside for the next feature? All right. What what is the next feature gonna be? The build quality on this damn behemoth. Shit. So I forgot to do this. <laughs> Damn, bro. Oh, what? <laughs> Rudy, fuck yourself. I am not gay. Hey. Hey. I'm Kyle Bush. Imagine. Im I squashed the dose box. Rip dose box. <laughs> Good job. Uh, those lives matter. Good fucking job. Those lives matter. Alright, so what feature were we gonna do next? You fuck Makoto, you fuck. <laughs> Makoto, I saw Michael's I saw what you sent Michael in his DMs. Fuck yourself. <laughs> And it's on camera, and it's on camera too, probably, it'll probably be edited out, but yeah. <laughs> Payback, yeah, busted! Anyways, so... No, you're not. We're, we are, no, Whoever nobody... Want, I'm gonna eat this if anybody doesn't want it. What do you mean, what do you mean? It's a, it's a, it's a, pizza. It's a, it's a it's a pizza. No shit, it's a pizza! <laughs> well, yeah. And Katie's initial on it, so I wasn't sure if you wanted it or not. Do you want it still? You sure? What's that? That is the that is that is the Epic 5 LL Bean edition that we reviewed last episode. Maybe not what we're doing anymore. Uh, and I see Javier is using you as a footrest. Hey, this is your call! <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh we're gonna talk about the build quality. No, 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 leave it there. For what you know no. who? No. The way you said that, I'm not doing that anymore. No, no, no leave it there. Maybe, maybe you know who might get up and out. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, what is my fucking problem? We we don't. Hey, to, to quote to quote some guy that I forget the name of. We don't know what we're doing, but we're damn good at it. Mm-hmm. Yes. All right. So. Check your DMs again. All right. So. Oh no. So build quality on the Vector VEC 136. So honestly, it's really well built. Like. Ah. Uh. <laughs> so. No. Nah, in all seriousness, it's uh, it's built really well. Uh, the TV part, I will say, does feel a little bit flimsy. It's not like to the point where it'll just like wobble and fall off the and fall off the base of the radio. The, the knobs are definitely interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, the D-pad looks like something that came straight out of a freaking 12382. That's true. These knobs are good, but the one the one complaint that I have about the about this tuning knob in particular, I mentioned this in the AM and FM segment, but it is literally half analog, half digital. What? Like, I will... I'm gonna mute the volume just to avoid copyright, but... Like, look at this. So, it's not as annoying on FM, but... Actually, it is kind of annoying on FM. Uh, are you fucking with me right now? It's soft-locked again! Are you shitting me? 
No. All I did was press the program and store button. What? Uh, I thought I did it again, but I think this might be a close second to the running snails bullshit firmware. <laughs> Alright, so if you take a look up here, so I'm tuning this at I'm sorry, what? What? Hmm? Huh? How did I get this to go to 86 point 86 point three? What? One oh nine what? <laughs> I have, I have somehow managed to tune this radio to 109 megahertz. Wait. <laughs> On the 86.6. I got it to 86.3. Oh wait. Uh, Drew, Drew, are you hearing this? 86.5 megahertz on the FM band, according to. <laughs> and now, and you. And, and one and watch, nine mega. And watch, and watch, I'm gonna put it to AM real quick. 1762. Yeah, it, it literally goes one. <laughs> it has a one kilohertz step. As a, it has a one kilohertz step. What's 530? Five 520. Five it doesn't even go. Wow. Wait, if it goes to 510 or 519, I'm gonna fucking lose it. <laughs> 1762. <laughs> Next thing you know, it's gonna say a channel eight. Oh god, nah, I would not do that. That, but yeah, see, this is the one thing that bothers me. The AM scrolling, actually, the FM scrolling isn't too bad, except for 86 point whatever the fuck. But <laughs> yeah, but AM is just as bad. Like it literally has a one kilohertz step. It doesn't. It's not 10. It's not 100. It's Fucking one. That's as that's as much of a bra moment as my whole entire life. My how is my ass an entire lie? It's literally fucking plump of what? <laughs> I mean, I was called, I was called, I was called Fickless in high school, I will have you know that. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're known as Thunder Thighs. Yeah, honestly, let it be known that Thunder Thighs all one is secretly a stripper name. Oh, fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> no, I am not, no, Mox, no, don't give him any ideas. Oh Jesus, Sage Christ! I'm not in there, so I can't. Yeah, so the flashlights are the flashlights are pretty good. For once, this doesn't fuck with the refresh rate. Mm -hmm. That is a shocker. Uh, the reading lights don't mess with it either. It kind of does, but it's not like it's not like freaking FRX five levels of uh of uh. Of, of a refresh fucking. One thing that does mess up with the refresh rate is the television. The television messes with it? Yes. Which was, which is as expected, because analog televisions, as well as CRT monitors and TVs of this, you know, type, they tend to mess up with the refresh rate a lot with these cameras. Uh. And it did that while I was reviewing the television function. Oh, can I, can I have that piece? Huh? May I please have that piece? The whole piece? Yeah, I, I may not. I, I, actually, Katie, Katie, may I have this piece of pizza that Michael is offering to me, please? Alrighty. So, I'll get to that one. I will. You, uh, Michael will do the final thoughts while I enjoy this pepperoni pizza. That is, it's good. We should order more tomorrow this, if you want. This pizza Why slice. This pizza. This pizza. This pizza slice is as big as my fucking face. We should order some more tomorrow. If you want, Rudy, I will, I will show you that I will show you how. Ah, son of a bitch! I knew, I knelt. Yep, I knelt on the freaking. There's this freaking crease on my basement floor that separates the uh, carpet and the and this hardwood floor, and I knelt on it, and my legs are hurting even more now. But if Michael would be ever so kindly, as to show your ass on camera. 
<laughs> so, I will show you. Well, this is like been big in my face. Would you, would you be so kind? So let me have my fucking phone back. It was like two slices in one, I swear. It is two slices in one. They didn't even bother to cut and cut this piece in half. They cut it into quarters. If you don't eat pizza like that, you got a problem. Cold pizza is the best. Anyways. Um... Anyways. Anyways, so yeah, I, I would agree that the build quality on it is pretty good, but the only fuckery thing about this thing is the goddamn tuning, which is half-assed digital, half-assed analog. 109 megahertz. 86.3. Yeah. Yes. Yes. It's still gonna be rated on it. And with that, we will get into the final thoughts. Finally. Holy crap. Thank you! You did? You sneezed on my arm. No, I did. Yeah, you did. I felt it. Better? Yes, a lot better. Better? Anyways. Ah, oh, fuck. Anyways. Um... On to the final thoughts. <laughs> Chandler, I am gonna fucking kill you. I will fucking kill you. You too, Mako Twat. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> I can say something that I will not. Damn it, yeah. Anyways, the final thoughts on the Vector VEC 136. Don't buy it. It's fucking worthless. It's a goddamn behemoth. It barely does the job anymore. Apart from weather band and AMFM, it's terribly oversized. The design on it is so fucking ugly, it's not even worth mentioning. And it uses way too many batteries to count. It's like, oh, if I, oh, I'm so, I, I, the moment when you want to say something, but you know you'll probably get cancelled for it in both the chat and on YouTube, so you're gonna fucking not say it instead? <laughs> call that, call that. Um, actually... Uh-oh. <laughs> um... Hmm... This radio... Oh, God... Hey. And I am, I am censoring this out. Oh, God. Wait. Hang on. Let me get some confirmation. Okay, I got confirmation. So, um, yeah. And, uh, Drew will instantly know what I mean when I say this. Yeah. The design of this radio is, is fucking terrible. It's like trying to stick your dick in a Cheerio. You know how that feels? Fucking terrible. You know how this looks? Fucking terrible. It's fucking ugly! It's as ugly, it's as, ugly as a cum-covered flavored Cheerio. <laughs> like, instead of the yogurt, it's you-know-what, but I'm not even gonna get into that. No. It's, it's egg. And I mean this in just in terms of the design. Other than that, it's like a big several hemorrhage. I I, I am getting a cerebral hemorrhage, just cerebral. <laughs> isn't that isn't that how you say it? Yeah, I mispronounced. What? She says she says she says something about you being gay. 
Of course she says that. Man, if she says that I'm gay so much, what does that say about her, maybe? But what? Does that mean she could possibly be gay? No. <laughs> Rudy, Michael just tried to call you hey! gay. <laughs> Snitch. Snitchless. Yeah. Hi, yo. Hi. I'm Kyle Bush. <laughs> I'm fucking curious as my PFP and I have interstate batteries on my car. My PFP is as green as the lightning bolts oh from interstate batteries. I drive the 18 Camry XSE. What? Be clear. What? 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 Oh no. Makoto. I'm gonna fucking. Makoto, so help me Mac God! You, oh you, oh you two-faced twat! <laughs> Oop! <laughs> Fuck you too! Anyways. Oh, Anyways, um. All right, let's get some more inputs on this radio's final thoughts. Okay. Would you? All right. What? 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 How is this charging? How is this charging? The sun's not out, bitch. Look, 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 look at this. Yeah. It's. Oh fuck! You can't see it. <laughs> like. What? It's it's charging and it's not even in sunlight. What? Maybe these lights have some form of superpowers. Uh, okay, I think I fixed it. Yeah, I might have, I might have possessed and before, it. And before it starts again. I swear to God. I might have possessed it, just so you know. Anyways, um, let me ask you this. If you were not a weather radio collector, would you buy this radio? No, I would not. Would you buy this radio? No. Would you buy this radio, Katie? No. Would any of you take the time to even process the thought to buy a fucking behemoth television set with weather radio band? Would any of you buy this? You know what I you know what I would do? No, 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 well, only if it's broken, I would play baseball with it. Oh Jesus. That's the only time I'll play baseball is if it's broken. Well, that's Rudy's opinion. Michael, I got two words about this for you. For you. Yes. It is, and I quote, fuck no. I mean yes. there you go. And even Chandler's joining in, so uh yeah. The amount of middle fingers shown in this video might get this video demonetized. <laughs> but, yeah. Anyways. Just don't buy it. This thing is worthless nowadays with its fucking analog television capabilities. But I cannot believe we actually went this far with reviewing such a behemoth of a radio. This is officially the largest radio we've ever reviewed. And with that, we are finally done. Yes, to date. We are finally done after this. Thank you all for watching this very devious episode of Radio Reviews Rated R. Oh, geez, yeah. So be sure to be, be sure to click like and subscribe. And I just noticed this was zoomed in, so I fixed that. Be sure all right, to click like, my, comment, yeah. and subscribe for more episodes of Radio Reviews like this to my channel as well as. Thunder Buddy 01s and North County 599s and Norfolk Southern Storms. And also subscribe to anyone I'll do this. who I'll has do. these people over here on Discord. Alright, so I will say I will say I'll do the honor of saying their names. I I subscribe to Chandler Fogel, with who is doing a very interesting face cam right now. And also Rudy <laughs> Octoling, subscribe to her. Also subscribe to Break Orb uh, or Break Orbit, even though she don't got a channel. Just give her some love. Uh, Chaos Mox, EAS Test Fan 25, Makoto Maniac, Mr. Riot, North Utah WX and EAS, Radioactive Girl 00, and Vanna Montana. All the all of their channel links will be in the description below, assuming Michael doesn't forget. No, I won't forget. Alright, we'll see about that. <laughs> God, we all need to meet up sometime. Yes, I want to make this happen. I want to make yes. a meetup with everyone in this VC happen. Yes. Pizza. I want cheese pizza. <laughs> yes. Wait, I called. I called the want cheese pizza at Domino's. Uh, uh, you realize that you ha that you have someone that's part New Yorker in this VC right now. What? You realize that, right? Yeah, I, Wait. I am, I am literally within 
like 50 miles of New York City and New York City makes the best pizza. I will say that right now. It is better than Domino's. New York style pizza all the way. Should we try it when we go there? Should we try Domino's? No, New York style pizza. A New York style pizza? Definitely. But I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry to anyone that actually likes Domino's, but it is garbage. Like, That's all right. At least compared to New York style pizza, yeah, Domino's is fucking shit. Yeah. Like, like New York style pizza is best. Anyway. I want to try it so bad. When we go over there, we're gonna have a fucking hell of a time. Absolutely. Yes. Just, just don't, just don't, just, just keep your fucking Play-Doh dick away you, from you me. Need a picture of that pizza, I'll be happy. Yes. I, I will get, I, I will try and get some pictures of New York style pizza for you, and don't fucking kick me. <laughs> do it again. You punch your camera, you won't be able to film more episodes. <laughs> Quit spreading your lives for me, bro. Bang your door. Oh Jesus Christ! Somebody left. Uh, th that was that was Riot that left. All oh, right. Anyways. Anyways, on that on that note, uh, thank just, you all for watching, everybody. Oh, you dick! I was gonna say that. Thank you for watching this and this extremely long episode of Radio Reviews. We rated really R. hope you. Yes, rated R. And, and on that note, this is Thunder Buddy 01 signing out along with Plato. Clay Ranger 143. Plato. Plato Ranger 143. Yes. <laughs> 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 no folks And these people here just say your just just say your names in the order of the uh, of the VC. One at a time, please. Yes, break orbit. Yes, 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 orbit. Oh. Oh. That doesn't matter. <laughs> Just kidding. Jeez. Have you forgotten? <laughs> Chandler renamed himself to Thunder Simple 3. So he's <laughs> dead last! <laughs> Fuck. So. Alright, so let's see. We did. Oh. What? I think I interrupted Makoto by accident. My apologies. Go ahead and say your name. Maniac. Okay, now my mic decides to work. <laughs> Boys. <laughs> Northern Dog WX slash EAS. Very active, girl, zero, zero. Pretty active, VA, and. I can't sleep tonight. I'm just coming next to the child. I can't sleep Someone remind me that I can't speak words. You cannot speak words, Rudy. You cannot speak words, Rudy. Just say speak words. English. As we see a wild well, play of dying in his natural habitat. <laughs> Let it be known that Michael is dying on the inside. Yeah, about that. <laughs> I keep thinking of the most fucked up shit ever. <laughs> oh no. Anyways. Um, I don't know if we mentioned his. I don't know if we mentioned his name, but also, but uh, Mr. Riot as well. We, uh, I, I, I said his name on behalf of him because he, he, also, he, yeah. Hey, hey, my boyfriend. Yes. And on that note, guys, we will see you in the next episode, whenever the flying fuck that will be. And it's gonna, <laughs> and it's gonna be about as devious as this one. <laughs> yes. Stay tuned. Okay, that was fucking weak, bro.